So guys, um, now it's time for the next round of our amazing 50 founders battle. This is the fourth round, so next 10 to go. I really kindly ask the jury to sit down here in the front row. Please, jury members, come here, sit down in the front row. You have these assigned seats with the papers on the chair. And um, I will introduce quickly the jury as well. So you all know the rules of this game. The game is simple. Three minutes on the stage, just three minutes. Uh, you will get to ask no questions as a jury. <laughs> you wanted to, I know, but we said, like, fuck that, we don't have the time. Uh, and they basically compete for 10,000 euros in cash with no strings attached, with no equity drawn away or whatsoever. You can go and basically, I don't know, drink the money until it's all done or go and buy a boat if you can afford one for 10,000 euros. So we have the best startups from Baltics, Nordics, and Central and Eastern Europe. We welcome the very first startup on the stage, Upmatch. Give him a big applause. Wait, fuck. Wait, can we wait? Can, no, no, don't go wait. Don't go wait. Stay on the stage. I wanted to introduce the jury. I didn't do that. Yeah. I didn't do that, stay here. Just, you can look at them personally. They're the most important people you have to pitch to. No pressure. So in the jury, we have Andri Degeler, Rockstart. Can you stand up for a second? Yes, everybody look at him. Very good. Uh, I, I, will, I will try to pronounce it, the name. Marius Parescius. Business High Vilnius, yes? Here, no? Ah, oh, he's missing. Look, I still <laughs> mispronounce it, maybe. Anwox, Estonian Business Angel and Network. Excellent, give her a big applause. <laughs> Stefan Ganshev, uh, Launch Hub Ventures. Applause. <laughs> Paul Christoffel, Corelia Capital. Yeah. Applause. <laughs> Excellent. We had one jury member missing in the last batch as well. It's okay. They, they just. Yeah. Okay, very good. For the same, okay, same thing. So now it's your time. Please welcome Upmatched. Hi, my name is Richard. I'm from Upmatched, and we're developing engaging messenger robots that screen leads for the employers. So when we talk about the labor market, we generally believe that they do not function well. From the one side, we've got job candidates who do not submit their application due to the process being lengthy and boring. From the other side, we know many recruiters and employers, employers that are really in struggle of filling the seats in their companies. Our solution is uh, engaging messenger robots, just like Sandy. They are talking to candidates on Facebook. They are screening. Um, they are trying to convince that work in one or another enterprise is great. And if the person is interested, Sandy later has, uh, does the pre-screening interview for this candidate, eventually connecting to the real recruiter. So we believe there is a fourth. Um, four uh, main values in, in our product. First of all, it's an access to passive candidates. Uh, the passive candidates are known to be uh, the uh, great uh, empl employees in the long term. Of course, through the engaging conversation with the candidates, we're able to build, boost the employer brands of our clients. It's a partial automation of the recruiting process. And finally, we're also building, uh, building a candidate database, or a candidate pip pipeline, if you will, that uh, employers are able to access in the, in the long term. Our business model for now is quite simple. We work on the project basis. So we develop strategical, creative, and technical solutions for our clients. And so far, we believe that we have, we compete mainly on two, um, uh, on two main values. So we give the biggest access to the passive candidates through using the popular social media platforms. And we, also, um, we are also pioneering in candidate engagement through building very engaging conversations through chats with our users. Our team consists of four people, and we combine our competence in marketing, HR, and IT. And we generally believe in creating meaningful workplaces. So far, we have had up to 10 paying customers on the market uh, in operating less than a year. And our customers on the Baltic market include also the leaders 
of the industries, including IT, in including communications and banking. And we have many uh, more customers right now in the pipeline. Not only the employers value our product, but also the candidates who have been chatting through our, uh, through our robots, uh, as, if we, as, as we see uh, from the cases that we have developed previously. And at the moment, we are looking for mentors who know about this, uh, who are very proficient in scalability parts. So we are looking for assistance in developing a scalable business model. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. The next up is a team from Moldova, Gauss. Give me a big applause, come on. Okay. Hello. Hello, anyone? Well, a lot of recruiters don't really hear any answer when they post a job ad. The recruitment of young talent is broken. Companies spend thousands of dollars on recruitment agencies, job boards, or professional platforms, but the results are not there. We are helping to fix the broken model. We created a recruitment algorithm that was specially designed for millennials. We took that algorithm and we embedded it in the technology that they are using it every day. Every hour, actually, the messenger. And our machine learning algorithms are learning from each interaction in order to provide the best matches between the multinationals and the millennials. We launched our product three months ago, and we already have offers and users from four countries. We have more than 1,300 millennials that used our solution to find their job, and we have more than 11 multinational companies that already receive pre-matched leads and start hiring talent. The recruitment market is big. We plan to focus on CE at the start. There's 25 countries, 60 million potential millennials out there, and a market size of $600 million. We tackle 1% of that market size in the next three years. We are a SaaS business model. We create uh, and give access to pre match lead with a flat monthly fee. We save time and money and give access not only to qualified, but also to motivated millennials. We are not alone in this market, but we know our strengths. Comparing to LinkedIn, we focus more on entry-level jobs. To solutions like Frank, we could provide faster candidates because our candidates don't have to download or install anything. To job boards like Monster, we actually provide the right candidates. And for uh, comparing to recruitment agencies like Hayes, we are cheaper, oh, much cheaper. My co-founder, Elian, spent five years in the HR department of a big multinational company, helping building and understand the HR processes from inside. He's also a seven-year Python developer, passionate about machine learning and data science projects. I spent the last 10 years doing recruitment, talking to thousands of young people and helping them get entry-level jobs. We have our first investors, and we are part of Startup Wise Guys. And also, one of our advisors helped get an HR company from a startup to closing Series A. We are opening our next fundraising round, which we plan to close by the end of Q2 this year. That should help us grow our team and become market leaders in the markets that we already are present. And that should bring us to a 25K MRR by the end of this year. But the most interesting thing about us is that all of you already have Gauss in your pocket. You just need to connect to it. And so are 60 million millennials out there. My name is Eugene, I'm co-founder of Gauss, and we provide a better way to recruit millennials. Thank you. Thank you. The next up is a company from Finland, AdLaunch. Give a big applause. Hello, Riga. Could we have some volume for the video, please? Okay, we'll no. skip it then. We don't need it. But you know that everybody likes videos. But still, creating good quality videos is damn hard. Even the largest tech giants basing their products on advertising have a hard time creating enough content for their demand. We're going to change this. 55% of marketers say that their biggest professional pain is creating enough video content for a growing number of social media channels. Previously, they could either order videos from a production company, but that's expensive and takes weeks to get, or they can try and take, do the content themselves. But you know how most professional video editing programs look more like a video dashboard than something practical to use. So most marketers ended up 
looking like this. They're stressed, but they can't meet their goals of creating enough content. We're calling our solution AI-powered video creation. This is how it works. We're able to scan through YouTube videos that already have a proven track record. Lots of views, how people viewed them, and how long they viewed them for. We're able to dissect those videos and see with image recognition what's happening within those videos. Use that information into creating new templates automatically for people to get good-looking videos right away and publish them straight out of the box. Let's have a look at the market. We're aiming at the Chinese market because we're getting Chinese investment. So that market has grown into a $12.5 billion industry. And the US numbers look very similar. Facebook themselves predict that 100% of their content will be in video form in the cu next couple of years. And 90% of users say that seeing a video about a product was very helpful in their decision-making process. We've got an award-winning team. We just won third prize in Slush in December out of 2,500 startups. And we've got a good balance between creative skills, business skills, and tech skills. This is what our service looks like. So we've created an automated, intuitive uh, interface where people can just input keywords. Say you want to create a sales video about your startup, uh, have summer young people and your product, and we'll automatically flip a video out of that. If you still want to edit it, you can. Just use the beautiful interface to make the changes you want. Our business model is a SaaS subscription. And remember, if you're thinking video, Sync Ad Launch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Why I say every time you should applaud? Because coming on the stage is like scary, so to give them a little bit of boost. And the next one, give a big applause to Alpha Blues from Estonia. <laughs> Woo! Thanks. Uh, hi, I'm Indrik. I'm the co founder at Alpha Blues, and we uh, automate customer service. So, why do we do that? Uh, the problem is that customer service is horrible for everyone. Uh, for people who reach companies, uh, I've never, never met anyone who really likes it. And for companies, it's actually really expensive. So phone, email, and chat all today are labor intensive. What we do is we automate the chat part. So we built our own product from ground up. Uh, we built AI in-house and the product in-house. And essentially, it allows to take in chats from any channel, web, mobile, social, our system is the frontline support. It tries to deflect tickets. Those that it can, great. Those that it cannot, it forwards to human support. So ultimately, what companies end up with is customers who get a better service faster and also savings in uh, human cost. What we do on the AI side, and like, uh, there's a ton of hype around AI, but essentially it's understanding natural language. So we're currently deployed live in eight languages. And the edge is that what we do is build an automated pipeline that analyzes with machine learning and deep learning algorithms the text that is coming in, so it's not rule-based. Uh, also, AI on its own is not enough uh, because uh, AI needs to be customized to make it work, uh, especially the enterprise market we're targeting. And so for that, we'll build a user-friendly product interface uh, for people to uh, use on their own. Uh, we currently have customers already in the uh, finance and telecom sector. Uh, we recently partnered up with Pricewaterhouse in Poland uh, to offer our services uh, and products to their customers. Uh, our focus is the Central European market. Uh, essentially, what we're competing against is, is IBM Watson. Uh, our business model is 80% product, 20% service. Uh, we are bootstrapped and we're profitable. And uh, what we're looking towards is gaining more access to larger enterprise customers because uh, there's a ton of self-made platforms. Uh, these are good for if you want to build your own chatbots or virtual customer assistants. The trouble with them is that they're usually not that, uh, they're not that great because the accuracy is not there, plus there's integration difficulties. So what we focus on is on the high-end solution that's actually able to automate. And it's not just customer service, it's also sales automation for selling mortgages or home loans, uh, which becomes very attractive because essentially you have a 24-7 sales guy on your site uh, capturing customers that otherwise wouldn't come to. So with that, I'm Indrik from Alpha, Alpha Blues. Thank you. Thank you. And the next up is Pomodon App from Lithuania.
Here. Okay. Hi. Hi. Well, it's a tough day, right? Pitches, sessions, meetings. I would like to suggest you, uh, well, use my time as a small break. Uh, silly question. How many of you knows what's so important, for instance, in Judaism about the Shabbat? Shabbat. Shabbos, Shabbat. Knows? Anyone? What about siesta for Spaniards? What about five o'clock? What the hell about the chill word in this? It's a chill. I would suggest now to make a five seconds break. Close your eyes. Relax. Breathe and think about something important, but something really pleasant for you. I'll just count. One, two, three, four, Five. You can keep your eyes closed, actually. And uh, what I would like to feel is that this break, this small break, it changes something very important now in the tech chill. And usually in your life, in your workflow, if you enjoy the break, you know, it is much easier to focus. It's much easier to avoid the burnout. So what, us, what we've done, we applied this break thing to the workflow. We applied time management on top of task management. So if you use any of these tools, you can continue using it. You can work as you worked before. But with our product, you can enjoy this small break during the days, just in time, to feel much, to be much more productive. We launched this product, and this is what we've got for about like a one or two years of, uh, you know, organic growth as a side project. This is about like a 300 euros of marketing during this time. So I believe you understand what this number means and what's going on if you're going to add some money into it. Uh, this is our audience. It's mostly freelancers now. We are moving to corporate part, and this is why we are looking for some sort of investment. Uh, this is our current model, it's the SaaS, so it's again self-explanatory. Uh, this is our team, which again, 14 years old web development company working for many different companies for the world as a service company, so we know how it works. Uh, we are looking for seed type of investment, pretty small one, just to go ahead, grow and bring more pleasure to the end of the day. And this is just a few words for our current clients. So our break, at least the one I would like you to enjoy, is almost over, but we have five more seconds. You can close your eyes again, and you can enjoy the break during this stuff. Thank you. Thank you. And now we will have a company from Ukraine, Sandstone. Please welcome her on stage. Do you need this? How do I switch it? Sorry. You don't have to switch it, just use it. Okay. Yeah. Hello, guys. My name is Dara, and I'm from Sandstone. We built a portable assistant for productivity. You know, as I was standing there behind the stage, like one minute before walking in, I had this promotion idea for the upcoming spring launch. And as much as it was unrelated to this pitch, it was very important to me, and I know this happens to you too, because it's scientifically proven that our best ideas and our most important tasks usually trigger when we can't write them down, when we're walking, driving, when we're talking to a customer, or even when we're sleeping. Well, bad news is we can't really control it because we can't control our brain, but what we can change is the way we remember information, and that's when Sandstone is handy. Actually, with Sandstone, you can calendar events, set reminders, and remember your notes easily, unobtrusive, hands-free, and on the go. All you have to do is share your note by voice with Sandstone. What Sandstone will do, it will first of all store your note securely, then our AI platform will organize your notes so you can easily search your notes by keywords, tags, location, and date. Sandstone integrates with your favorite apps so you can easily speak your notes to, let's say, Evernote. It also works offline, so never you have to worry whether you're in range or not. 
My journey with Sandstone started on Kickstarter as I was one of the first backers of this product and I was not the only one. We actually have over 3.5 thousand backers from crowdfunding, which helped us raise over $400,000. And currently we have 100 devices being tested by beta testers as we prepare for the launch this spring. We surveyed over 1,000 of our customers and we also interviewed them and we found out what they do and how they find Sandstone useful. So we know that they seek to raise their productivity with our product. Our team mostly comprises of engineers, people with experience in startups and wearables, also marketing and sales, Oxford and Stanford graduates. Our advisors are former HP, Google, Pebble, and McKinsey. Currently, we are raising $1.5 million to launch the product to the market and accelerate the growth. We, uh, my name is Dara, and I'm from Sandstone. I invite you to talk to me, to try Sandstone, and to join our story. Thank you. Thank you. Next up, our guests from Germany, Tripalista. Please welcome him on stage. Come on! Hi, my name is Dario. I'm co-founder of Tripalista. Tripalista is a social platform to simply plan and share your travel stories. The most popular content when planning a trip is from users themselves, from travelers themselves. The problem is finding and collecting all those great tips and advice into one place, into one clear plan. Our content is scattered on multiple websites. We share posts on Facebook and Instagram. We write reviews on TripAdvisor and Booking.com. And we plan our routes with Google Maps or other tools. These websites generally don't connect to each other, and we need to visit each one separately. Tripalista created a solution that integrates all these great websites into one simple platform. We customize Google Maps, so in just a few clicks, you can create even the most complicated route, showing every aspect of your trip on the map. We partner up with the biggest booking websites to bring you photos, reviews, and prices for all the content you create. And if you're just planning a trip, we bring you recommendations from those websites for attractions, hotels, accommodations, and transportation. Photos are a big thing when we're traveling, and so Tripalista connects with Facebook and Instagram, so you can upload your favorite pics from your trip. And of course, we are a social tool, and so we make it easy and fast for you to share an elegant post with your friends and social network. The result is a beautiful collection of travel stories created in minutes, all connected under one map, allowing users to search filter and compare trips in minutes, and find the content relevant to them from their favorite resources. A proof of a good time, such as a review or a photo, can have more of an of a impact than any call to action or last minute deal. The travel online market is growing as users want to plan and customize their own trip, their own travels. Our business model is an affiliate business model. We make commissions from leads coming from all our partners for hotels, restaurants, attractions, cars, flights, and more. We are a team of two, self-funded. We have more than a decade experience in our fields, and we are seasoned travelers. We have a growing base of daily visitors and contributors to Tripalista, partnerships with the biggest online travel companies, and a roadmap ready for further features and development. My name is Dario Reichmann from Tripalista. Please feel free to come up to me and chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Next up is seniorship from Estonia. Welcome around the stage. So hi, everyone. My name is Anna Elisa, and I'm going to tell you how to fix labor shortage. So let's start with a little story. It was the year 1980, and there was a chef who used to make a pizza that had three slices of mushroom and one slice of cheese topping. Business was going great. Years went by, and it was 2018. The chef wanted to keep making the same pizza because it was selling so well, but he had a problem. 
There weren't enough mushrooms anymore. And at the same time, he had plenty of cheese in excess. So what does all of this have to do with labor shortage? Well, what if I tell you that the mushrooms that aren't growing anymore actually represent the negative birth rate occurring in Europe? And the cheese that's getting moldy because it's left aside is our aging population. The elderly formed 28% of the European population back in 1980, and this number has grown to 40% since then. The forecast says it will reach 47% by 2040. That's nearly double. And the elderly are also breaking stereotypes. Being old doesn't equal to cooking pancakes and knitting socks anymore. People want to learn, work, and stay active, but academic education is not fit for their needs, and they want change from the jobs they've had for decades. So here's where we step in. Seniorship is a web platform that offers internships for people with decades of work experience. It's a new type of learning for the elderly, a bridge between education and full-time jobs. We offer internships that teach new skills, anything from banking and teaching to cooking and medicine. The platform itself features a job portal and an online social community that's designed particularly for the elderly, where they can ask and answer questions and participate in experience consulting. Our business model is very lean, and we charge a commission on each transaction that's made on the platform. We are solving Europe's socioeconomic paradox. We shouldn't have labor shortage in a situation where so many elderly people are willing and able to work. And what's worse, lacking options and staying inactive makes them very vulnerable to diseases like Alzheimer's, dementia, and physical problems. The labor shortage is particularly rough in banking and insurance. And these are the industries that suffer very much from employee turnaround. And to this, we offer loyal and experienced workforce. People who don't run away as soon as they hear the words routine tasks. People who know how to work in teams and value what the company has to offer to them, not vice versa. The bottom line is we're one step ahead since we're focusing on a target group that shows immense growth but lacks service providers. We're stepping our foot into a segment that is emerging today and will dominate tomorrow, and we're looking for strategic partners in doing so. Thank you. Thank you. And the next up is Smarts Hub from Belarus. Come on! Thank you very much. Hi, I'm Dennis from Smarts Hub, and we do revolution in advertising. The first AI Google Advertising Assistant. Many years ago, people spent 15 minutes to make a photo. Right now, they can make it using their smartphones in less than one second and with high quality. But can you imagine that people still need more than three hours to make a good advertising campaign in Google? It's Nikita, a certified Google trainer, and he spent three hours to make a good advertising campaign in Google for his clients. And it's Margot, creative entrepreneur and my wife. And she doesn't use Google AdWords at all because it's too complicated for her. Together with my team, we have created an AI algorithm that can make Google AdWords campaigns on a professional levels in less than 20 seconds. And the process is so easy that even the first time users can do it. Just five easy steps, and it's done. We put it in the Facebook Messenger chatbot, so anyone can go and, ch uh, and check it out absolutely free. Just follow the link. The market is huge. More than $36 billion are spent per year only in the US. And there are around 50 million of struggling freelance ad specialists and small business entrepreneurs who are struggling with Google AdWords right now. We have a classical SaaS model and three packages according to the number of features. We plan to go to the market with three things. First, virtual assistants and messenger, already done. Second, plugin connected to huge website builder platform as an ad feature, like Wix.com, and web platform. That's in progress. We have attraction. We have virtual assistants and messengers, and uh, 530 active users and 16 paying customers just in three months, and a clear exit strategy to a huge website builder platform. There are around 20 competitors on the market, but they either do general marketing automation, or they deal with e-commerce only, 
or they're too complicated, just like Google AdWords itself. We have an amazing team, ex-Amazon employee, Google trainer, UX designer who worked with Google, I'm a machine learning guy, Google AdWords automation expert, and a smart sub board who is trained right now to become the first AI Google AdWords specialist. We are fundraising 200,000 euros in May this year. So those of you who are interested, please catch me. AI assistants are already here, and we are the first in Google AdWords. Thank you very much. We love you. Thank you. And now the last one in this batch is S. Parking from Estonia. Please welcome him on the stage. Thank you. So, this was it. Sorry for the last hiccup for the uh, sound, but the jury heard everything, didn't you? So if you did hear everything, uh, then uh, you will have to now uh, get to go and do your jury duties, uh, judge them judgely, <laughs> and uh, we will start with the next panel.